Hi guys, it's Lynn here. I hope everyone is having a blooming lovely day. Now today guys, this is just a bit of an update on my beautiful orchids that I have here in my uh, plant grow room, which is also my office. And I have uh, quite a few blooming beautiful today to share with you. And first of all, I'm going to show you um, my little miniature pink flowering foal there absolutely gorgeous this is one of the miniature varieties and this is absolutely stunning tiny little little red blooms and lots of buds more on the way so that's really beautiful and then here i have one of my white flowering um phalaenopsis uh, orchids here with a big bundle of gorgeous blooms and uh, lots more buds on the way very very beautiful and as you can see there lovely yellow inside and the lovely sort of deep red as well in the middle absolutely gorgeous and then i have another um fowl as well there which has got a much bigger larger big bloom on it there and uh, a larger variety as you can see and more deeper red and more of a golden uh, yellow in the middle absolutely beautiful and buds as well on the way and what's quite remarkable about this fowl is it's actually a cakey that is actually flowering on the mother plant this is the the mother plant here um and it actually it formed a cakey obviously a couple of years ago and i kept it on i was going to keep meaning to pot it up and put it into its own little pot but i kept it on and uh, as you can see it is blooming beautiful absolutely remarkable there and then i have here one of my dendrobium gorgeous in blooming beauty absolutely lovely bunches and bunches and bunches of blooms and uh so good to see this um, lovely little pink on the edges of the the blooms as well there very very beautiful i've had this um dendrobium nobili now for a couple of years and it's bloomed twice uh, it was blooming when we bought it bloomed last year and blooming beautiful again this year so wonderful to see sorry i can't get any closer i can't reach because of the table <laughs> but hopefully you'll get to see its beauty there and mother Dend dendrobium nobili is also um coming into bud too as you can see there this is my other one which is a a pink flowering variety so good to see there's buds on this one also very very exciting and the, the orchids that we have, we have five different types of orchids here. Um, obviously the Phalaenopsis, the Dendrobiums, and also we have um, Epidendrum as well, Zygobatalum and Miltonia. This is our... Um, this is our Miltonia and this is Miltonia Newton Falls here. That's also blooms beautiful for us in the summer. And Isaiga Batalum, which we've got here. This one um, has usually a lovely um, deep purpley, very heavily scented blooms on it as well. And then we have my little Epidendrum Ibeguense. And um, this one has not, uh, not yet flowered for us yet, but hopefully in the future. And uh, just wanted to share an update on, we only have a few small um, orchids in our collection but obviously um we'd like to have more in the future and as the rest here's mainly all cacti and succulents that are overwintering here in the grow room and a lot of these will be going back out into the polytunnel for the spring and summer months hopefully not too long now and guys thank you so much for watching and i want to send you loads of love heaps of happiness and tons and tons of flower power from across the Emerald Isle. And until the next video, bye.